This video shows the digitize section to 3D polyline command. This allows me to take an existing drawing or PDF and digitize it into cross sections. In this case, at station 10 plus 00, I have a ditch cross section that I want to draw in plan view. That way I can create a surface from it and use it for whatever purposes that I have. To run the command, I can type digitize section to 3D polyline command at the command line. And that'll open up a palette. On this palette, I can enter in the alignment that I want to use, in this case, stitch. If the drawings changed, I can refresh the sites list. Here, I want to specify the top elevation, and that's going to be the top elevation of my cross section. In this case, it's 140. Next, I want to enter my cross-section station, and this is 10 plus 0, 0. My bottom elevation, in this case, is 80. And my default station interval. That's going to be the interval between this section and the next section. So it looks like I've got a lot of non-standard sections. Um, but if, I, if there was sections every 50 feet, I could enter that here. Since my data is not uniform, I'd have to type in and revise the station each time I change stations. But if it was even, the next station would automatically be incremented to the correct one. I also want to include the offsets. Here my offsets are found within the section view properties. And so here I have negative 25 and positive 25. And then I can either select a digitized polyline. So if I could draw a polyline along the section and then simply select it, or I can pick the points. I'm going to draw a polyline just to show how that gets created. So here I can select the digitized polyline. I can select the points of my section view. And then I can select the polyline. It's going to draw some temporary graphics. And then in plan view, it's going to take that polyline and draw it. So I can then go to my next section, type in the station value. I can then digitize the section, uh, make sure that my top elevation and bottom elevation are correct. And then I can digitize the section by clicking on the points. So I want to pick the section view and then digitize the points. of my section. And then here's that next polyline. And so then I can do it for all of them. And then once I have them all done, now I have something that I can create a surface from. And so that's how I can digitize sections. I'm using either polylines or picking the points. Um, I could also select a polyline in the section view. And so this is the digitized section to civil 3D or to 3D polyline command found in the sync panel.